cab, sunny cab, sunny cab. Good afternoon and a very warm welcome from me. And I first want to say two things. The first thing I want to say is thank you. Thank you for spending your time with us this afternoon. And the second thing I want to say, I can promise you now that the new NC60 is way more reliable than this curve. Let me tell you. However, what I, what I want to uh, talk to you about today is, is a little bit about a little bit more about the car, and more importantly, why we do what we do. And then I'm going to talk to you about also how and what we're going to do within within Volvo Car Thailand. And the reality is this: this car, this new XC60, had a really hard act to follow. And the reason for that is that actually we sold over one million previous XC60s across the world. So we knew we had to make sure that this car was absolutely spot on from the start. Now, we have um, a lot of things that we do, and there's a lot of things that we focus on. And what I want to talk to you about, first of all, is technology. You heard from Jonathan earlier that we have a lot of technology in our cars. But we don't just put the technology in the car because we can. If you remember, everything we do at Volvo starts with people. And people are the people that are in the car every single day of the week. They're the people that are going to use it, both in the rear seats as well as in the front seats. And what we're going to do is we basically put the technology in their car for one purpose and one purpose only. And that is to make the users of the car's lives easier. It's as simple as that. But we also want to evolve. So for example, city safety. We have had city safety since 2008. But we keep refining, we keep redeveloping. So, for example, on the new XC60, City Safety now also has steering assist. It will be there waiting for you behind the scenes just in case you need it to work for you. We also have lane mitigation system. Lane mitigation is nothing new, but we now have steering assist. And it will help you when you're driving down the road to stay within uh, the lane itself. And of course, if there's something coming towards you, it will also steer and make sure you avoid head-on collisions. We have also taken pilot assist to another new level. So pilot assist is our semi-autonomous system in the car. And it will work up to 130 kilometers an hour. So you can use it on the expressway. You can also use it in downtown. But more importantly, the car will brake for you. It will accelerate for you. And now it will also steer for you. So you can have a semi autonomous experience with the new XC60. And Jonathan talks about Bowers and Wilkins and, and the, the amount of attention to detail that we put in to the audio system inside the car. Bowers and Wilkins premium sound system is standard in the R Design model here in Thailand. And the reason why we've done that is because we are literally bringing the Gothenburg Opera House in Sweden and we are putting exactly the same sound experience inside your car. We tested extensively Bowers and Wilkins in Gothenburg, which is the home city of Volvo in, in Sweden. And trust me, you really need to experience this in order to believe fully what I'm saying. We talked about the center screen, or Jonathan uh, mentioned about the, the, the center display screen. There is only one reason why we have this center display screen. You can control every single feature of the car, from Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, to all the systems in the car, to climate control. But it's easy to understand, it's easy to use, it's intuitive, 
which again makes your lives easier when you're inside the car. So, T8. We are the first manufacturer in the sub and the compact SUV segment to offer a plug-in hybrid. The reason why we bring the plug-in hybrid into Thailand is because you not only get 407 horsepower, which I think you will agree with me is more than enough for a compact SUV. But what it does also give you is 47.6 kilometers per litre, so you get incredibly powerful car, a fantastic driving experience, but you also get fantastic fuel consumption as well. So you're literally getting the best of both worlds and there are no compromises whatsoever. It's also very, very good for emissions because obviously you can drive in the city and also on the highway on pure battery power only. So we focus on technology, we focus on the people that are inside the car, and it makes the car a nice place to be, but it also makes your lives easier on a day-to-day -day basis, and that is something that we are going to continue as we move forwards with our new products coming forward. Now I also want to mention about Volvo Car Thailand and what we're going to do in Thailand because you heard from Jonathan that we focus very much on the details, the very small details that go into all our cars now. And that's fantastic, that's exactly where we need to be. However, we also need to focus on the very small details when it comes to our customer's experience in dealing with Volvo cars. And we want to make that experience more personal here in Thailand. So we will continue to roll out Volvo Personal Service. That is where you will get a one-to-one -one interaction with the technician that works on your car. Very, very important for communication, but more importantly, very much a personalized service. We've been leaders in safety especially road safety, since 1927 when Volvo Cars was founded. And we're not going to stop. We will continue this journey. And we need more and more people in Thailand to drive our cars. Because we don't just focus on the people inside the car. We also focus on the people that are outside the car. That is the reason why we put so many safety systems in our cars but also why we make sure that we extensively crash test every single car, also with dummies on the outside of the car, to make sure we make as minimum amount of damage as possible should something go wrong. Safety has always been important to us, and it will remain important to us. And you see a quote from our CEO, Hocken Samuelson. And this is real. He has said, nobody will be killed or seriously injured in a Volvo car by 2020. That is two years away from now. And we will get there. We will get there for sure. So that's a little bit about the car. Now, there is one other thing that I'm sure you're sat there thinking right now, and that is, yeah, 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 very nice, Chris. We've heard all about the car, and we've heard about what you're going to do, and how you're going to change things, but uh, what's it going to cost? How much is it going to cost me to buy one of these cars? So, I think it's time now where we actually tell you what we're going to charge for uh, the all-new XC60 here in Thailand. First of all, the D4 all-wheel drive. All our new XC60s here in Thailand will be all-wheel drive. The D4 momentum will start at 3.09 million baht. We will then bring in the T8 Momentum, the plug-in hybrid version. Now you heard me say that plug-in hybrid car is very important to us. Reason for that, and the reason why we're going to bring this car in, is because we're going to charge only 3.29 million baht for the T8 plug-in hybrid Momentum. It's 200,000 baht more than the diesel. And finally, if you want this, not him, but if you want the car, um, you will be paying 3.59 million baht for the fully loaded T8 
our design XC60. So there you have it. That is what we're going to do. We are bringing our design into Thailand for the first time, and I will promise you now, we will expand our design across other models as well as we move forwards. I think we want to give our consumers here more choice, and we will continue to lead, certainly in the areas of safety and also usable day-to-day -day technology. But we will make sure that we bring the right cars into Thailand for Thailand and not just because we can. So with that, I just want to leave you to enjoy the cars because that's what you're here for, not to listen to me or to listen to Jonathan. So I would like to thank you very much for listening to me. Thank you again for coming and I will speak to you all very soon. But cop and cap and thank you very, very much. Thank you very much, sir.